This is it. Church of San Juan. Let's split up. I'll look for signs of Lopez. We'll ask around, see what we can find out. My friend Sara's an archaeologist. She works near here. You wanna go see if she knows anything about your riddle? That would be great. The stone faces have always been Sara's obsession. Most people come here looking for treasure, but not Sara. She just wants answers. Have you been friends a long time? Since we were kids. She was the nerd, I was always skipping. Abby, can you help me with this? It's broken. Hold on. Are you that Lara? Croft? I am. I recognize you from your picture. What's your interest with this place? I'm following a riddle. The heart of the serpent is in the cup near the many stone faces. The stone faces? That's why I'm here too. I don't want to step on your toes. It's the serpent in the cup I'm really looking for. Well, I can tell you the faces have been here for at least 400 years. According to documents in the library, they keep watch. Legend has it, they're guarding a secret crypt. A crypt? We've never been able to find it. As you can imagine, that's what drives the treasure hunters crazy. But if the infamous Lara Croft is as clever as they say she is, well, if you were to find it, you might be doing me a favor. You think I should start at the library? Yes, it's over by the cemetery. It's one of the oldest buildings here. Make sure you credit me if you find anything. Thank you. I will. Did you say someone's missing? Yes, Isabella. Another member of the field study. I checked on her after the first tremors this morning, but her tent was empty. You should ask Manu. He probably told her where to find El Dorado. This is serious. We had a fight last night. A bad one. I'm sorry, Guillermo. I didn't realize. Please, continue. You had a fight. I don't mean to pry, but... It's all right. We've been very close friends for almost a year, and I think both of us would like there to be more, but... neither of us has broached the subject. Isa and Sarah, they often don't get along. Sorry, Sarah, but it's true. Because Sarah insists on her team being very down-to-earth, while Isa has a passion for folkloric tales of hidden temples. I often get caught in the middle. Those stories always come from somewhere. Even if most of it is made up, there'll be some kernel of truth to it. That's Isa's viewpoint, too. Anyway, there's an old blind man who lives here named Manu who's full of these kinds of stories. He convinced her there's a secret creep hidden around here, and last night she asked me to come with her and find it. I refused, and we got into the old fight. It ended with her calling me a hidebound coward, and me calling her a... a foolish child. So she ran off. Yes. To as she put it, prove all you naysayers wrong. This morning I heard rumors that she vandalized the cemetery last night. That's when I started looking for her. When I found her missing with no one knowing anything, I started to worry. What if she went looking for the crypt and something happened? I can never forgive myself. All right. You stay here, so if there's news or she comes back, you'll know about it. I'll go looking for Isabella, starting with the cemetery. You'd do that? To be honest, I'm as curious about that crypt as she is. Laura, you find anything yet? Abby's friend mentioned a crypt somewhere around the library. I'll meet you there. Be careful if you go out to the graveyard, miss. A witch lives there. She likes to turn people into frogs. I'll be sure to watch myself. One lady upset the witch, and then the witch made her disappear. Hard work is good for the soul. The sect has been maintaining this mission through hard work for over 400 years. Angel de la Cruz and Truilos Serrano arrived here back then and immediately set to work. Their philosophy of labor being the only true way to get closer to God 
is one we still follow, even now. I can't quite explain it, but have you noticed how the world seems thinner here than in other places? Like, it's just a curtain drawn, and if you found a cord, you could pull it and see heaven itself. There seems like a tangible connection between this life and the next here. Or maybe we're all already dead. Or maybe I need to get out of the sun for a little while. Seems like every few years, God throws a disaster this way. I can see that the earthquake caused a lot of damage. Nothing we can't fix with enough time. And materials. Unfortunately, one of those is in short supply. around here somewhere a secret crypt why secret if lopez is involved there's bound to be a trick that's a solid theory what about you did you find anything i got a pamphlet seven steps closer to god <laughs> who knows maybe it'll help like a mausoleum. Mm, means we're on the right track, right? Jonah, I feel something. We're getting close. Let's look around for signs of Lopez. These notes were written by the founder of the Sector 7. They're talking about funds allocated for renovations to the library. like it's from the 17th century. Refuge under his wings, and under his wings you may seek refuge. All full up, can't carry any more. A heron and an eclipse. Thank <laughs> you. 
sun will be darkened, and the moon will not give its light. Jonah, those two Bible quotes. The sun will be darkened, and under his wings you may seek refuge. What does it mean? That's it. Look for a heron and an eclipse. Tardaremos eternidades. ¿Cuántos años? Un paso a la vez. Selección. There's a whole mural under here. Veracruz, <coughs> <coughs> the true cross. Is that what I think it is? The silver box. It's unmistakable. Jesus takes up the cross. These are the stations of the cross. But there's a bunch missing. Before 1600, there were only seven. This could date back to the time of Lopez. This is one of his clues. Yeah, it's the kind of thing he does. All right. Let's see if we can find a cross lying around here somewhere. When we find the boss, how do we get the key back from the big case? We'll find a way. That's the young to have all that responsibility. Must be pretty hard for I can only imagine. Found something? Yeah. Jesus takes up the cross. Help me lift this. <laughs> Looks like a long way down. 
Let's see where this leads. Station two. Jesus falls the first time. There's an inscription here. Adulate dum lucha habitus. Walk while you have the light. the light so that the darkness may not overtake you or a threat this looks like a station three jesus meets his mother He's accepting the cross here. There's a woman in this one. Look, someone else got close. He wasn't as lucky. Looks like the light activated something. Laura! Are you alright? You're lucky it was a little rusted. <sighs> this must be station four. Yeah. Let's have a look at these frescoes. Someone else got close. He wasn't as lucky.
there's a woman in this one. Is that what I think it is? The station's at the cross again. But with mummies, isn't this sacrilegious? Not necessarily. They could have been paying the ultimate homage. Or they were just sick. This must be Station 6. Looks like a church. These ones are posed by monks. Uh-huh. They're carrying him. Lifting him. She's wiping his face, I think. So hold this stage the whole crucifixion. I think this was a place of worship for an underground sect. Mm -hmm. Jesus nailed to the cross. I think he's taking up the cross. He's carrying the cross. That inscription, do not fear those who kill the body, but are unable to kill the soul. Is that meant for us? Don't let Lopez get in your head. He's caused enough trouble already. his face, I think. Uh -huh. They're carrying him. They're lifting him. She's wiping his face, I think. I think this was a place of worship for an underground sect.
need to direct the left light beam toward the scene of Jesus being nailed to the cross. Jesus, nailed to the cross. disciple wall him in and then bang no witnesses Only the hands of the Righteous One may seize destiny from mine. I guess it's you then. He led us on this goose chase. He sabotaged every clue. All to keep this box from Trinity. And the people of Paititi. Totally consumed by it. Where is she? I don't know. I just need the box. Fuck you! Well, I guess we're done here.
Stop! Let him go! Release him, and I will give you the box. Laura, what are you doing? I've lost enough people. <laughs> I know you have. Your father was brilliant. He was taken from me before I could know. He was my friend. But he was obsessed, relentless. You didn't know him. He refused to see the potential for destruction in his work. He had to be stopped. You had him killed. He was going to lead the public to buy Titi. Everything I love, everything I fought for. My world would have been destroyed. And what about my world? <laughs> you can't think it's the same. It is to a nine-year-old girl. I was a child. There was too much at stake. An entire civilization, hundreds of years of independence, thousands of lives. I had no choice. There's always a choice. It's not too late. You can honor Unaratu and restore the sun. No. The threat must be removed. You're a low, selfish, murdering coward. And you, Lara, how many lives have you ended? Hmm? In pursuit of what? Laura, go! Stop him! change in our status, he'll tell us. Gotta hand it to them. This is a heck of a place to live.
Rourke. Jonah Maeva has the box, and Lara Croft was last seen in the church. Find them. They just left her alone in the church. It was chaos in there. Obviously. Something over here! It's crap! Shit, I wonder! Jonah, where are you? I'm in the cane field. They can't see me. Keep your head down. I'm on my way. Commander, let's go hunting. Croft, I know you're out there. I should have killed you in Siberia, but Dominguez was against it. That's on me. But I'm gonna fix that mistake. Now. you in Siberia, but the Mingez was against it. That's on me. But I'm gonna fix that mistake. Now.
Hey, 